And welcome to a game that really should have pulses racing. Every reason to believe this will be enthralling. My name is Derek Ray, and with me in the commentary position is the Arsenal legend Lee Dixon. And we have live action from the FA Cup to bring you today. It's Brentford, and they face Walsall. Well, thank you, Derek. With being big favourites, complacency can be a problem. You've got to use that to your advantage if you're playing a home side as expected to go through. Can they put the pressure on in the first 20 minutes and hold out and then try and nick the game in the second half? Well, here's how the lineup looks for Brentford. If you like wingers, you'll love this league. Yeah, absolutely. I love to watch a winger play, especially with pace and power. The central striker will stay more or less in front of the goal. The support will be provided by the three central midfield players. The back four is pretty conventional, but the fullbacks will be asked to support from behind. This is how the visitors will set up today. It looks like a conventional 4-4-2. A preferred formation by Arsene Wenger when he arrived at Arsenal. Two main strikers, four across the midfield. Really important for the full-backs to link up with the wide midfielders in this system. Thank you. Enjoy the game. And the game begins. Wonderful challenge and a throw-in coming up. Christian Nurgard. Jensen. What can he do from here? The goal seemed to be at his mercy, but defenders don't always have to touch the ball to have an influence. No, it's that pressure that comes from the defender that makes him hurry his shot. Close. Beautiful pass. Now he must favour the cross. And a half-baked clearance. He's enjoying space. Great challenge, he got nothing but ball. And it's a quality pass. Getting forward. Surely, a brisk start and a quick goal. Well, the manager would have said, keep it tight at the back and see if we can nick an early goal, and they certainly have done. We can take another look here. I'm sure the keeper is frustrated with the defending. Just afforded too much time in the box, and he's never going to miss that. Well, let's have another view of that goal. Opening goal of the game, then. Given away. Might be able to get in behind the defence. Ben Rama. That's a very impressive piece of defending. Gordon, he's protecting it effectively, Christian Nurgard, Ben Rama, here's Nurgard, an awful lot of green space to run into, the timing was perfect, it had to be, Sadler, 
McDonald. Intelligent threaded pass here. Just drifted into the illegal position offside, in the opinion of the officials. Mococcio on the ball. Oh, and a perfect ball now. How about this? Maneuvering his way forward. Has a go. Wonderful block. But he's gone short with it. Now they've lost it. Real danger. Must score! Well, a moment he would dearly love to have back. Well, listen, he's tried to hit it too hard. Just relax a little bit. Focus on your technique. Given away. On and on he goes. It's there for him. And finishing there with more of a whimper than a bang. Oh, he's given the ball away. Oh, he's missed it. Oh, goal behind Derek, and he's missed. It's a big miss. The visitors are struggling with possession, really, but they won't mind with that. They're winning this game. They're sucking their opponents onto them, and with the pace they've got in midfield and up front, they're really causing problems. Can he open the door to a potential goal? Will it be? Well, it's all going so swimmingly for them here. Another goal, and now it's a matter of avoiding any silly mistakes. Well, he's gone for pure power, and why not when you've got a rocket in your boot? What a strike. Well, a second goal for them here. Goal for Warsaw, number eight, Liam Kinsella. Henri. We've been waiting to find out, now we know, a minimum of three added minutes here. Said Benrama. Camohelo Mococcio. Mbermo. Mococcio on the ball. And so it is, the first half story has been written. And the game begins. The two teams have switched around and are ready now for the second half. Well, that's very smart defending and now they have the ball again. Good looking ball, there could be a chance now. An abundance of space. Well, they stopped them just when they looked menacing. Paris Saint-Germain have been busy in the transfer market. The contract situation had, and fed forwards. Might be a chance here. Big chance it is. Well, that's a procession of goals. And surely there's no way they can let this slip now. Absolutely dominant. Well, here it is again. You're trained from a young age to get in those sort of positions. And never in any real doubt he'd finish that. Cool and composed. Well, it's been such a one-sided game. You just wonder how many more they can add.
Well, that's a really good authoritative tackle. Throw in here. They've decided that now is the time to go to the bench. On the ball, Jensen. There's a slide draw pass. And a half-baked clearance. Breaking at pace. All the all, a broken counter-attack. And 30 minutes left for play in this match. To the nearest you. Thank you. And the cross is very much on. Cutting the ball back. Straightforward take. Getting news of a goal in the Everton game. Alan? It's a third goal for Everton. 61 minutes played, 3-0. Alan McAnally keeping us right up to date. Moving forward effectively. Can he take the chance? Well, it's goal after goal after goal. Just no end to this. A brilliant display. Obviously, it's a tough in Derek, but it's the patience in the box I like. A predator's instinct, just waiting for the ball to come to him. So they restart the game, and only one team in it. Not much defensive cover there on the flank. Options in the centre. He'll be delighted to have won the ball, having made that difficult challenge. And the corner has been given. And over comes the corner. Fisted clear. Gordon. Robbed them. Powerful enough, but not precise enough. No, not accurate enough at all. He had other options on as well. Well, it's not a case of not creating. Just look at the stats. They've done that. But you have to put the ball in the back of the net. You have to be more clinical. You have to put more pressure on the goalkeeper. They haven't done that today. This could be an interesting avenue. Running towards goal. Well, they can say a big thank you to the goalkeeper. That was inspirational. Well, that's as good as a goal at the other end. Brilliant save from the keeper. No end product. Can he put it away? And he's only gone and made it a hat-trick. Well, when he's in this sort of mood, he's absolutely unstoppable. What a performance. Well, here's the replay. You have to say he's been a thorn in the side of the opposition all match. It's a good finish and a richly deserved hat-trick. And as they restart the game, it's fair to say the gulf in quality between the two sides has been huge. Splendid tackle and a throw-in coming up. Let's get an update from Goodison Park, where there's been a goal. Alan McAnally can tell us about it. It's another goal for Everton. Eight minutes remain. 4-0. Thanks, Alan. And whipped into the box. Well, a sloppy clearance. What can the opposition do with this? Not really close to worrying the scoreboard operator. No, it's worth a try, though. But when he looks at the position he is in, he'll be disappointed he didn't hit the target. Inside the final five minutes now. Might be able to set up the chance. Can he make it count? And he's fired it against the post. Well, you can't come much closer to scoring than that. Henri. On and on he goes. Well, it was a risky challenge, but brilliantly executed. And three minutes will be added on for stoppages. Mbermo. Jensen. 